Did you know that we're having a very own Pride? Bay Pride. We are um, as part of the Wyndham Fringe. I'm sponsoring it. I am a proud sponsor of the Bay Pride March. I also support and sponsor from my two businesses, JLR Sound Home and a little known bookshop. I'm a Greens supporter. I'm running for Greens Council. As a Greens member, I 100% support it. So we've got the Bay Pride coming up, right? I told you about this. I keep banging on about it. Wenham Fringe is an amazing, amazing uh, experience and an event that brings the Bayside alive and brings everybody together. So anyway, in saying that, 26th of, uh, 26th of November, we've got the Pride March. And I know uh, Tony and Callum at Bay FM who were, who were championing this and, and wanted this. You lads have just been champions. Now, some lovely people around town threaten to boycott this lovely, family-friendly, all-inclusive march. And you've got your kids on board. Gay love, straight love, bisexual love. Your Christian values are old and outdated. Now the police have spoken to me over a post saying that we're going to meet opposite a house on the Esplanade and I've never ever called for anybody to stand in front of their house. And I've never ever called for anybody to stand in front of their house. We're going to be standing right out front of your house, buddy. We're going to be standing right out front of your house, buddy. We're going to be standing right out front of your house, buddy. So anyway, no, no, no to the no, no house. And we are going to stand in front of your house. So, the 26th of November, at 12 o'clock, the Pride March starts at the jetty. At 11 o'clock, opposite the No House. We're, we're going to meet right opposite the infamous No House. So if you wish to join me for a peaceful little picnic, a very, very glittery gay picnic across the road, all are welcome. I put up a photo of where we're meeting. I put up a photo of where we're meeting. I put up a photo of where we're meeting. You need to have your bubble burst. I will fight fire with fire. You will see that what you're doing actually does have consequences. You guys really are the epitome of the bottom of the barrel. These people are unhinged and are dangerous and disgusting in every single way and need to be stamped out. And we stamp it out. And I will fight, I will fight you with- And to every one of your bigoted followers, we're gonna have a thousand of those who oppose that. So your homophobia can be shoved back in the closet. But every time you think you're rising up, we're going to rise up tenfold. So you understand that we are dealing with deranged and unhinged people here. Because you're not going to win. I trust that you'll get this message. I don't give a rat's patootie. I'll probably get in trouble for this, but I don't really care. You can come at me with defamation. You can do whatever you want to do. I don't care. I've got to go. I'm just going to get in so much trouble for this, but I don't care. We're going to be standing right out front of your house, buddy. But Wynnum's Fringe Festival is tonight at the centre of an ugly protest. That's mean. It's, it's bullying. These flyers promoting this weekend's Pride March event have been dropped in letterboxes across Brisbane's Bayside. It's got a picture of a boy with a gag mask on with the words fancy dress and it's got a child kissing a man with the words kissing classes. This has not been made by us. 
fake flyers organisers say is hate speech. Can't stand down to bullying. This sort of stuff is not okay and we have to point it out. 